Mr. Lopez. Good afternoon, everybody. My name is Alfonso Lopez. I'm a member of the House of Delegates from South Arlington. I'm going to tell you a story. I'm not going to do the litany. I'm going to tell you a story. My dad was one of 22 brothers and sisters from the same parents. When he was 19, he didn't have much opportunity in Venezuela, so he saved $260 and came to America to find a, the American dream. He worked as a busboy, he worked as a waiter, he learned English, he went to Northern Virginia Community College. Then while, taking, while working two jobs, he took one class a semester every year at George Mason University until he graduated from college one month before I graduated from high school in Fairfax. My mom and my dad fought to create a lifetime of opportunity and promise for me. That's why I have made it my mission to pass the Virginia Dream Act because every 19-year-old child trying to find an education in Virginia, I see the face of my father. I see a brilliant student yearning to give back to Virginia, to give back to America and to create a life for themselves. <laughs> On paper, the economy in Northern Virginia is doing really well. Stock market's up, unemployment's down, but we all know as Democrats that far too many families are struggling financially. I'm running for Congress to continue creating opportunity for families that work hard and play by the rules but feel like their chance at the American dream is slipping through their fingers. That's why at the SBA I worked to pass the Small Business Jobs Act. That's why in Richmond I fought to build on Mary Margaret Whipple's work and create the Virginia Affordable Housing Trust Fund. And that's why I will always fight for hardworking families who feel like they might be left behind. Like my dad, you know, I also have hopes and dreams for my little boy, Aaron. A lot of you met him. He once vomited on Mike Lieberman's desk. <laughs> he is brilliant. He's incredible. He loves science. He loves math. He, wants, he tells me something about the solar system every day. When we're driving to school in the morning, we should be talking about what he wants to be when he grows up. A scientist, an astronaut, an engineer. Instead, I think of myself, I think is today the day that a gunman shatters the happy chaos of his school. Instead, I think about what kind of environment, what kind of climate he's going to have, whether or not he's going to be able to grow up healthy and strong. When we have these things to think about, when we worry about these issues, we are moving backwards. Like my dad, I'm running for Congress to create a better life and a brighter future for my son and for all of our children. I hope to have your support on Election Day and at this straw poll. And together, we can continue to create a brighter future that we all deserve. Thank you very much.